Hello friends, this is Manish Pandey. Welcome back. Uh, this is MS Access Automation Season 6. In this video, I am going to show you how to fix this error, undecognized database format and this is your database file name. So I will help you to fix this issue. But before that, if you have not seen my previous video, you can go through that. That will help you to understand this one. This error occurs while connecting UiPath Studio with MS Access. So let me show this error first and then I will show you how to fix that issue. So let me open UiPath Studio. So here you can see I'm going to use one connect activity to connect UiPath Studio with the MS Access. So I'm going to click on configure and then connection wizard. Here I'm going to click on MS uh, Microsoft Access database file. I'm going to select this by default selected one press OK, click on browse and I am going to select this database. Now click on test connection. So you can see we are getting this error, undecognized database format. So if you are getting this error, it doesn't mean that you have to install any Microsoft Access database engine. No need to install or no need to search for Microsoft Access database engine on Google. What you have to do, I'm going to show you. You just need to follow this this thing that will help you. You have to install Microsoft Access 2013 runtime. Basically, I am using 2019 version of Microsoft Office. So this 2013 version will help me help me this. So let me show you how to download this and how to install that. You have to write Microsoft MI access 2013 runtime and then you have to click on this link microsoft.com this website do not go anywhere you can just go here and from here you can see this is microsoft access 2013 runtime you can select this your language as per your language now click on download and here we are getting two files 64 version and 86 so we you can try with 86 version that will help you now click on next so once you we'll click on next it will start downloading if it's not starting then you can directly click on this here click here to download manually from here also so that will again you can retry that so I have already downloaded that so let me show you that so I have downloaded this one now let me just install that So it is done now. Now just click on close and here click on connect configuration connection wizard. Select the database file, browse, click on this, click on test connection and you can see still we are getting this error but what we have to do and now this is the older one that let me just close that and let me open this again because sometimes it takes some time to you know update to the system so I'm going to open this same again click on connect configure go and select that file click on browse open click on test connection and now you can see test connection succeeded now if you have installed this MS Access runtime like Microsoft Access 2013 runtime and still you are getting error then you know what you have to do here you have to click on advance and then you see might be there Microsoft Jet is selected so if Microsoft Jet is selected then you can what you have to do you have to go to the advance and you have to remove this one you have to select this Microsoft ACE it means this is Microsoft Access version old DB database right data provider you have to select that and then press OK and then test connection so by that way you can solve this error and that will help you to establish a connection between UiPath Studio and MS Access 
and you can select OLTT and then you can start sending query from UiPath Studio to MS Access. So I hope it will help you. So please press the like button and please subscribe this channel. And I have started my new YouTube channel Pande 2.0. So please go through that and please subscribe there. Thank you so much guys. Thank you for watching this video and thank you so much for all your support. Thanks. Bye.